What's up everybody? As you all may know, uh, Minecraft has updated to beta 1.4. So I will be updating all the mods that I have already uploaded um, tutorials for. So <clears throat> as they update, I'll do tutorials for them. So first off, my first mod tutorial I did was too many items and it has updated to 1. Point, or 1.4. So I'm going to do a tutorial for that. And again, if anybody doesn't know what this is, if this if this is your first time seeing this mod, I will show you it really fast. This mod is super easy to install. Um, it's actually kind of easier than last time, and this time I will be showing you how to manually install it. Because the last time I showed you with a program, which seems to be really buggy for a lot of people. So basically, if you hit I... It'll bring up your inventory, and then here's what the mod is. Shows you all the items in the game that you can give yourself. Um, this is a cookie. Uh, my texture pack is uh, screwed up because the game updated, so you can't see the cookie, unfortunately, right now. Um, I'm sure the texture pack will update soon, and then the cookie will show up again. But anyways, this is the mod. So if I want like a diamond axe, I just click on that, and there you go. I have a diamond axe. Uh, I don't want this cocoa beans or the wheat, so I can just go ahead and drag these over to the trash. You can give yourself armor. Where's the armor at? Let me give myself some diamond armor. So there you go. You got a helmet, chest plate, leggings, and boots. Then you can just put them on. So it's basically just an in-game inventory editor. And um, you could save your your things. So if you have a bunch of things in here and it's like a nice setup with all like diamond tools and diamond armor and everything, you can just click on save and then um, it'll bring it back up. So if I put this over here and I click on load one, you'll see that it put the diamond pickaxe back in there or the diamond axe back in there. And then to toggle this on and off, like if you're going to record and you don't want people seeing this, just hit O on the keyboard and it'll bring it off and on. So that is it for the mod, and I'll go ahead and show you how to install this now. I'm going to need to clean out my Minecraft jar really fast, and I'll be right back after I'm done doing that. Alright, so I cleaned out my Minecraft, and I'm going to show you how to install this now. So first off... All you're going to need is just the mod itself. You don't need mod load or anything like that for this mod. So you're just going to go ahead and I'll give you this link. And you're going to scroll down so you see download current version for 1.4. Go ahead and just click here to start download and then save it to your desktop. I already have it so I'm not going to save it. Now what you're going to want to do is if you're on Windows 7 or Vista you can just go ahead and click on start and then type in percent app data percent and it'll show your roaming folder and then you'll go into your roaming folder but if you're on um, XP what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to type in run and then you're going to want to open up run and then in run you're going to type in percent app data percent and then just hit OK and that will open up your roaming folder then you're going to need to open up your dot minecraft folder you're going to need to go into your bin and go to the jar file that's just called Minecraft and you're going to need WinRAR or some sort of archiving program for this and you're just going to click on it right click it and since I'm using WinRAR I'm going to do open with WinRAR so we don't need that open anymore we just drag this to the side open up too many items um, copy these two bottom classes and drag them over hit OK you do not want to put this readme text file in here so make sure you don't do that so a quick tip is to click on this uh, first class file hold shift and then click on the GP class file right before the readme text and then just drag that over and hit OK and then there's a folder in here called meta inf if you have that you're gonna want to you're gonna want to delete it because that'll stop the mod from working so right click it delete files yes and now that's gone so there you go now you're good to go you can go in play too many items play with, play, blah, 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 play around with too many items and um, you can use this online if you are if you're op if you're an op you can use this online 
Um, you can give yourself items. It just won't work the same. It'll just spit it out in front of you, though. So, yeah, that's it. Thank you for watching. Like I said, um, I will keep posted on the mods as they update. I'll keep re-updating them. So that's it. Thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next time.